How's it going guys? Frank Z here. So, like I said, it's the weekend. Look what I got. This is a lithium iron phosphate battery pack. These are A123 cells, cylindrical cells. We pop the cover here and check the voltage of the one pack, and it was at 39.8. And it's a 12S pack, so that brings it to its nominal voltage. 3.3 volts or so. So, this is number one of, hopefully I can get 10. Which would give me about 100 kilowatt hours. Each little pack, each 40 volt pack. Contains 96 batteries and they're in 12S 8P. So, anyways, this is the first video of the series. Thanks, guys. Here it is, guys. Got the lid off. Dun dun dun. I was supposed to get a storm, so I wanted to get stuck outside doing this. So, you've seen these cells before. Ontario Off Grid has them in action right now. But he's used a full pack plus cut one. And then added that, so he's got 16S instead of a 12S. These are 12S 8P packs. Supposed to be 740 watt hours. You can see 40 volts. Supposedly. Each one of these has its own BMS. There you go, right there. BAE module energy, 736 watt hours. Honestly, they test at 39.4, 39.3 volts. It's a heavy duty pack though. This is 800 pounds right here. Really wish I could just use this whole pack, but I'm not sure if that's what I'm going to do or not. Pretty sure if I just hook three of them up together, we'll gain my 120 volts. Let's see where the power comes from. Well, I guess this whole side right here is uh, live. There's a plate right there. Hard to see. They all look really good. Great shape. I got eight, eight or ten of these packs total. So, <clears throat> should be close to 100 kilowatt hours of power. Some crazy fans. It's all part of the package. I can bring all this back for scrap and get some money back. Or I could just keep the fans. They're probably really high voltage fans. Yeah, 
would be pretty cool. If I could use the whole BMS system and everything. Looks like it's going to be fun to come off to. Got like super glued on every terminal here. I believe each one of these is a, a one in series. Like, you know what I mean? So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So then it's a eight, eight in parallel, eight little batteries in parallel, and then twelve groups of eight. Gives you 96 cells. Total here is like 1,530 cells. And I got times 10, so I have about 15,000 cells going. It's pretty hectic. Anyways, thanks guys.